Hi everybody, Colby from Four Quarter Butcher Shop here. Today we're talking about hanger steaks, baby. Um, hanger steaks, so it actually gets its name because it hangs from the inside of the rib cage. So where your tenderloin is ending right here and your, your rib is ending right there, on the inside of the rib cage, the, the hanger's gonna sort of hang down there, interestingly enough. And um, what makes this cut interesting is that it's sort of an imperfect cut. When you get it, it's two pieces when it's whole like that, which makes it um, a little different. And also, it's, it's different every time you get it. Every time, it's gonna be different shapes, different sizes. One side might be bigger than the other. This one actually looks pretty good, pretty even for the most part. Um, the tough part about butchering it is to get this piece of sinew divided nice and cleanly. And how we do it here is that it starts here and it's gonna come down on an angle. So you just wanna sort of put your knife gently, not applying too much pressure, right against that piece of sinew. And you almost let, wanna let the sinew guide where you're cutting rather than your knife doing the work. So if you, if you did it well, there should be no sinew on this side. There's a tiny bit of sinew here, so I'm just gonna clean that up. But typically all of the sinew should be on one side. So that's one piece. And like I said, it's an imperfect shape, so sometimes it's hard to, to flatten it out and get the right angle for butchery. Once you find it, it's as easy as just getting your knife nice and flat with a sharp angle against the table, against that piece of sinew, because it's a tough piece of sinew so it can handle that knife and handle that pressure. And that's grabbing here and pulling on the sinew. My knife's not really moving. And that's the piece of sinew right there. Still a little trim there that needs to be cleaned up. And then you just want to go back and check your work. A little bit of fat there. Still a little piece of sinew that you want to get into. And there is some fat in there. You can go in there and clean it up. Personally, I like it on there. Um, and that's that's pretty much the hanger steak. Uh, if you check out our uh, stories on Instagram, then there's going to be a little demo on how to cook this. And uh, I'm glad you liked it.